morning and welcome to Mormon Times. Children are our greatest assets, and as Elder Elton Perry taught in General Conference, as parents and grandparents, we have a tremendous responsibility to teach and rear in righteousness. Lessons taught in homes by goodly parents are becoming increasingly important in today's world where the influence of the adversary is so widespread. While other institutions such as the church and school can assist parents to train up a child in the way he or she, she should go, this responsibility ultimately rests on the parents. Well, joining me now with some ideas on how parents can do just that is founder of momentity.com, Nicole Carpenter, and glad to have you here. Nicole, you've come up with some ideas that are especially useful for parents of school-age kids. What is it that you do in your home? That's right. Well, last fall, I had the idea that I wanted to do something with my kids before they went to school in the morning that would help them center around the gospel a little bit, but it had to be more than a prayer, but not much more than that, because the mornings are really busy, Right. very so, stressful. So you call them devotionals? Yep, it's called Armor Your Children Devotional Series, and because I did it for my own home, I thought, well, other moms probably want this too. So I post it on my blog every month, starting last fall, and I was so surprised by how popular it was. I didn't realize other moms would need this in their home too. And it kind of went crazy over Pinterest, being pinned, you know, hundreds of times, over and over again. Well, obviously there's a need for it out there, so how can parents use it? Well, it's really simple. It's a free download on our site, and it's a PDF file. So you can print it out and put it in a binder if you want and leave that binder at your table or in your kitchen. Or my favorite way is just to have that file on your electronic device, your tablet or mm -hmm. your phone. And then we just read the scripture. There's just one scripture every morning and we, you know, we go from the devotional series right over to the gospel um, app right there in the tablet. Well, that's great. And you said you've even confessed that you've used it in your car before. Absolutely. <laughs> Mornings are so crazy. So there's times that we read the scripture, drive to school, and talk about it on the way. Mm -hmm. and, and does it appeal to a certain age? I mean, can you really have something for a two-year-old that's going to appeal to a 10-year-old? I think so. You know, these are just family values, gospel-centered values. So even though a two-year-old may get something different out of it than a 12-year-old would, it's still just a family value based devotional. Okay, so have you noticed a change in your home because you've done this? You know, I think okay. so. My kids are still kind of little. I've heard from other moms that have older kids that their kids request it every morning. Mm -hmm. In my house, mornings are really busy and stressful, and that means the tension level is high. And that's hard as a mom to stay calm. But this devotional series helps us put peace back into our home in the morning and keeps us focused. You start the day in a yeah. great way. Plus, then I have more confidence as a mom knowing that I'm sending my kids out with a gospel topic on their mind before they go into the public that school you've system. armored them. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Okay. And the thing I like, too, is this just isn't for LDS moms. It's for anybody with Christian values. Absolutely. Yeah. I wanted this to be something that moms all over could, could really relate to. So each week there's a Bible verse and then a Book of Mormon verse that go together. So you can read both if you have time or just pick whichever one you feel most comfortable with. There's some options out there. Absolutely. Last question is, how do you mm -hmm. appeal to the mom out there who says, you know, I I'm just up to my eyeballs. I cannot fit in one more thing, especially in the morning. What would you say? I know. It's hard, right? Mornings are yeah. really busy. Oh, there's a lot going on. But our, our children are important. And so if we can just, just give it a try. Just give it a try for one week. Pick a topic that you think would be important to your children and give it a shot. It only takes about a minute, maybe three at the very most. Okay. Thanks so much for being with us, Nicole Carpenter from MomEntity.com. And we'll have a link to the Armor Your Children devotional series posted on our website, Mormon Times TV. KSL.com. Well, she is 